Hello guys, so today we're gonna need a pencil, we're gonna need erasers, we're gonna need crayons, you need more crayons but I'm gonna use these two the most. Um, obviously you can use more. And let's start, we're gonna do a very simple portrait of Rosa Park. Alright, so let's start with our initial shape, it's gonna be an oval. Right, let's do the eyes, similar to the ones that we did before. So we're gonna go here, we're gonna do half a circle, half a circle, and then letter C going up, letter C going up. All right, we're gonna do a little circle here, another little circle here, and shading the rest. All right. Now we're gonna draw the nose. We're gonna do a little outline first, which is just the outer line, right? And then we're gonna just circle a little bit of the shadows that I see here in the photo. Not too much, and then I'm gonna make the lines to close it up. Awesome. Okay, and then I'm gonna do the lips. I'm gonna do it very simple. She was smiling, so this line for the lips is gonna go up, and then I'm gonna do a V here in the middle, and then unite it on the sides, on the other side, and then a bottom lip. Alright, and let's not forget her iconic glasses, you know, here we go, and a little line here, and then her glasses, awesome, alright. Okay, and then this side, you can make it with a little line, yeah. Now let's do the hair, oh, the eyebrows too, we almost forgot about the eyebrows, can you imagine? Okay, there you go, and the eyebrows kind of go also under the glasses a little bit, there you go, and then on this side, it's you can see all the eyebrow. Okay. Ta da! That's very nice. And then the ears. Like that. And then this one here. And then let's do the hair. right like that and then here awesome and then now the other side okay and then the same thing here all right i think this eyebrow is too like tall, but I mean I like it. I'm not gonna erase it, I thought about it, but if you wanna erase it, you can make it match this one, so you can make it a little bit lower. Um, but if not, if you like it, I particularly like it, so I'm just gonna leave it that way. And remember to shade in your eyebrow, you know, and also the hair as well. Ooh, okay. This is our portrait. This is our portrait. Okay. All right. So I'm gonna make this line because she has that little crease when she smiles. So I'm adding that up as well. You know, that's cool. Um, but if you don't want to, don't add it up. I mean, I'm seeing right now. I'm. 
I'm not very fond of it. So I'm just going to erase it. I, I didn't like it. I mean, this is when you decide if you're going to make it look like the picture or you're just going to make it simple. So I'm just going to keep it simple. Awesome. I think that's it. And now I'm going to move forward to the neck area. So this is the neck area. Da da da. Da da da. She has her jacket here. It's actually like a like a shirt. So it's a little bit higher. And then this part is here. And this part is here. Here. And then this goes up. And then here there's a little vest that she's wearing. So I'm just gonna go like that. Down. This is a continuation. This is also the little vest that she's wearing. Let's see. I think I can make it go down this way. And it was like that. Ta -da! And this is the line of her blouse. I'm going to add a button. Just because. So it can make it look nice. And then this part right here. Looks like this. And then I'm gonna go up. Oh, I think that's as much as you guys can see. So that's okay. That's okie dokie. All right, let's see. Yeah, I did a little bit of this. Okay, and now let's color it, guys. So you can color it whatever color you like. Uh, obviously the hair is going to be black, so just start coloring your hair black. The eyebrows are black, we've already done that. Um, her skin tone is dark brown or brown, so if you have brown, it's okay. If not, remember to shade in a medium tone with your values. Um, what else? You can color the shirt, any, and the shirt and the sweater, any color you like. Why? Let me see. This helps. Okay, why can you color it any color? Is because I'm working on a black and white photo and I cannot really tell what were the actual colors of the shirt and the vest. So just feel free to color it any color and don't forget to color in your background and write her name on the top, you know, Rosa Parks. So let's do it together. Just so we remember Rosa and then here parks and you can go over the name with your crayons too so you can add a little bit of color all right so I'll fast forward and show you my final result all right guys thank you so much for watching this is my final result I hope you guys like the video